guys, um, I already hear John vlogging downstairs. I told him to do like a time lapse of us getting ready. Um, but today is Thanksgiving and I wanted to vlog just like a little bit of our day today because um, we're having some people over. We're having, I think, two of John's co-workers over and we're hosting it. And um, it's the first time hosting any type of event here in the house. So I um, just wanted to show what we have a little bit. We don't have a lot, like I said before. Um, it's the first time we're living together and on our own, so we don't have a lot of furniture, we don't have a lot of things. We don't even have enough stuff for more than four people, so that's kind of interesting. But I'll show you guys what I've set up on the table and the whole process of today. And I'm just wearing a black dress and some stockings and my beautiful pink hair that has been very light lately. If you guys can see, it's gotten way lighter and I love it. Here we have the turkey that we got, so I'm gonna unpackage it. And then with some butter, rub some butter along the top to make it nice and crispy. And we throw it in the oven for about an hour at 350 just to warm up because it's already been cooked. So we got our meal from Whole Foods. The whole meal, everything that we come with, feeds four people. And then it comes with these little instructions, so we know exactly what we have to do to heat it up, to warm it, to prepare it. But each each one basically has to be warmed up. Your potatoes, your ham, or turkey, or whatever. And then they have the um, appetizers and sides and what to do for those. But they, they each have like a oven or microwave option for how you want to cook it. But this this is what the menu kind of looks like. All we had to do was pick it up at the store this morning. Three ways to order. Um, pick it up at the store this morning. It came in this big box and then we just heat it up and serve it up. We'll wait until that gets to 325 and then it will sit in the oven for about an hour. So you can't really see too much of it, but I've rubbed some butter all over the skin. Hopefully it will stay moist and make it nice and uh, crispy. I have these like placemats here that I got in my pop sugar box that I think I'm going to use. And you can use these like pencils that are white and you can just write things on them. So I'll just maybe write the person's name and or happy Thanksgiving or something. Um, so I'm pretty excited because I've never used anything like this. So I just put the plates but I just remember that I have these so I'm going to put them on right now. So I just set the table. Um, I was gonna write on these, but like as you can see, there's like not really too much space with the plates that we have. So I just decided to leave it the way it is, but I like how it looks. Um, so I'm really happy with it and they're on their way, like I said. My dad just tried to FaceTime or like video chat with me right now from Cuba, but I'm like, uh, they're on their way and I need to set things up. Um, I haven't talked to him in a couple of days, um, so. I feel bad, but I told them I will do some type of video chat on Saturday, hopefully. So if we're not too busy, we'll probably do that. But the turkey, like John showed you, is right now on the oven, and I'll probably start preparing my pecan pie. Um, I'm not going to do it from scratch. Um, I need the filling, yes, but like the crust, I'm not going to. I was planning to do the crust. We're kind of like short on time, and I, didn't want, I haven't done it before, so I don't want to mess up the crust and the taste bad or anything like that. Um, so I'll do that some other time. John wants me to make him a pumpkin pie too. <laughs> um, but he's watching soccer right now um, with Wilson. And I'm going to go ahead and start the rest of the stuff. Our laziest helper today. Hi there. Hey baby. Are you ready for the people? Yeah? You're so cute. So these are what I'm using for my pecan pie. Um, I have some pancake syrup, organic, um, some sugar, some flour, some halves of pecans, and then some chopped pecans. Um, I actually bought two because yesterday we went to Whole Foods and they had like completely wiped the half of the pecan, so I figured I would just add more. Um, but today we went to pick up our food and they had the halves, so I just bought a bag of those. Those will go on top. Um, and then I bought the pie crust, because like I said, I'm short on time and I haven't done it before, so I might as well um, just <laughs> let's not 
mess that part up. And I just melted some butter, so I'm waiting for that to cool down just a little bit. Um, and that's pretty much it. And I will mix everything in and put the crust, and then I'll put all the stuff in, and then we'll have, hopefully, a good pie. <laughs> And I forgot, uh, it also needs four eggs, which I believe I haven't taken out, but I'm gonna add that too. Okay, so that was a fail. So I unrolled the first one and it kind of cracked because I missed the first section of instructions which says to let them sit out for 25 to 30 minutes. So I'll let it cool and I'll use the other one. Good thing it comes with two. They probably do that on purpose. <laughs> so I just put some salmon out with some crackers with cracked peppers. And I'm gonna put some brie with some fake jam um, and some walnuts in the oven and it's gonna taste so, so good. So our guests are a little late, so I figured I'd show you how things are going. I got some hummus and pita and some chips and some salsa. And I put some butter out for our actual bread, but um, that way it's a little bit soft. It's already soft because I left it out pretty much all day. And some fig jam that is on my brie. Let's check up on the brie. Ooh, I think that's ready. It looks so good. So there's the brie. Um, so I just cut up, it's a triangular piece of brie, and then I cut slices into it, put some fake jam, and then added some walnuts on top um, just to get some crunchiness in there as well. And it looks delish because now it melted on all the parts that I cut up. I don't even like brie, but I think I'm going to like this. <laughs> something at the end of the video um, since everybody already left and um, I was gonna go edit this vlog um, so it can be up probably tomorrow um, but I just wanted to say that we had a really nice time and everybody was really into the vlogs but I didn't like record everything just because we were kind of having a nice time um, but whatever I did shoot everybody was totally like for being in the vlogs 
Um, but yeah, we had the food. Um, my pie came out pretty good, but it got kind of burnt. I don't even understand why, but I think it might be because uh, the filling was kind of like overflowing, but like I didn't even put the full time. But anyway, it came out delicious. It still was very good for my first pie, so I'm not complaining. Um, and the food, like I said, was really good, and everybody had a nice time. Um, after we finished eating, we kind of just hung out and talked, and then after we went for a walk around the neighborhood, um, we were going to take Wilson out, well, John was going to take Wilson out, and then we just kind of all went on the walk, so we went on a freezing cold walk, and me with my dress. <laughs> so yeah, we had a really nice time, and I hope uh, we can do this next year. Um, I was going to do a Cuban uh, actually Thanksgiving this year so maybe I'll try to do that next year and do some Cuban food we'll see <laughs> hopefully we have more silverware and more plates and everything to get more people here but it was really nice and I hope you guys liked watching this video and hope everybody had a nice Thanksgiving Bye.